we have managed to get right inside the piano now. We've taken the strings and the keys off and the key bed off and we've got right down to the harp. The next thing is to take this big black frame, which is cast iron, out. And in order to do that, we need to remove any accoutrements which are currently pinning it in place. It's really important to be super careful whenever you're moving pianos around, especially when you're laying a piano frame or a full piano down on its back. You get all the weight going through your arms and you need a good technique for stopping your fingers getting trapped underneath the pianos. So this is our technique. What we're gonna do is we're gonna spin it round and we're gonna use these chocks, which are just two bits of wood that we've taken from some other pianos. Um, we'll lie them down. You can take all the strain, use your knees to take the weight and easily, slowly lift it down. There. So once you get inside the piano and you've got it laid down, you'll notice there's all sorts of little bits inside. This piano has um, these wooden blocks which are actually pinning the cast iron frame down. Um, and so we'll use this trusted screwdriver to get in there and unscrew. Now hopefully once we've undone that, I'll just tap free. So let's see. Oh, look, it just comes straight off. Every single piano that we've found is very different from every other piano. So you end up just having to work it out. And that's that out. Lovely. So I'll just tidy things up a bit by removing the two pedals. And again, keep the screws for later. They'll come in handy. There's a couple of bolts which have square heads on them. This is a 17 mil head so we'll just unscrew that and next we're going to take all the screws out so a neat tool for this is the brace and bit but you can also use one of these this is a fat boy is that was oh no it's a yankee and it's really fun to use if you can find one on the internet or something it's like a old school power drill. It's really pleasing. <laughs> Collect them all up, drop them in the bowl as well. And I think that's the last screw. So here it is, it's ready to be pulled out. Now, uh, harps are made from cast iron, so they're incredibly heavy. So it can help to get a friend to lift it up. Um, you might need to do a bit of jiggling to get it out. Remember to use your knees and not your back. You don't want to strain anything, so just jiggle it up. That's it. Lovely. And just place it over here. What a beauty. So the next stage, now that we've taken the harp out, is to take the side boards and the top board off. Thank you. 